guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Star Flames. Listen, King Charles is forced to do the right thing, I believe, after that um, image of Meghan, Harry, and um, their kids that circulated on Twitter yesterday. It was R-E-C-I-S-T, if you guys haven't seen it. It basically depicted them to be a black ghetto family, like ratchet, the worst, Megan wearing hoops, thick full lips, you know, pregnant belly out with the kids, Harry looking like a, you know, ghetto dude and all of that. It was very, very atrocious. And what happened is that Twitter went in and dragged um, the post that shared that image. So I believe that this article that is saying Kate Middleton downgraded incarnation move as Megan to be the star. I believe that they're just trying to do a PR, you know, cleanup of what happened yesterday. Not just that, what has been happening, you know, up until this point. I believe that um, Charles wants this coronation to be good. It's given the sense that the royal family is on edge and they were hoping that Megan would come so that she, she would take some of the blame, possibly, and not just take blame, but also to give them some clout and some media coverage. Because if Charles get booed, they can blame it on Megan, right? Because Megan is the girl that is being labeled as ruining the royal family. So they thought that they were smart, but Megan Marco is showing them that she's a lot smarter than they are combined. But let's talk about this article that I came across, and it is also including a body language expert that is analyzing the photo that, you know, the royal family had shared. I'm going to just pick out a few sections from this article to get to the key points so that you guys understand what this body language expert is saying. It says, Kate Middleton has downgraded in the last minute shock coronation changes at the as the king promotes Meghan Markle to be the star in important preparation for the event, it has been claimed. Now, <clears throat> as I've been saying, they need Meghan Markle for the spotlight because guess what? Meghan Markle is the only one in the family that truly has the power to carry them or cross them over into different media outlets. You know, if, if uh, Meghan Markle shows up, you know, she'll be in the Caribbean media right? Will the Caribbean cover the Grand Carnation? You know, a one article, maybe one, maybe two paragraphs the most, but not much. But if Meghan Markle is there, they're going to talk about this happened. It would be a series of reports. They're not going to get that without Meghan. So what, it, what they're doing is basically promote Meghan to be the star, hoping that she would feel loved and accepted to show up. But Meghan is not going to fall for that trick. As a matter of fact, She's busy working on her own project. But let's continue with this article. It is saying Megan has been given a major boost by being positioned as the star of the show in the official photo selected to represent the royal family at King Charles' coronation, a body language expert has revealed. It says Buckingham Palace has now released the beaming image of seemingly close-knit family crowded around Charles for the historic occasion report the mirror but let's talk about what this body language expert is saying about this right now it says megan has also made the decision to snub the may 6 event choosing instead to remain in los angeles with her children leaving harry to face the music solo despite their distance King Charles has made a huge step to carefully select a photo that shows megan and harry as firmly part of the family and this is why people are going to finally realize that Charles is not fit to be king. There's no way he should be in this position. And he's a, you know, embarrassment to the monarchy and to the people of England. And this is how Charles will be dethroned. <laughs> Listen, let's talk about what else this article has to say because it's really interesting, right? Now, it says... Um, so Prince Charles firmly decides on the photo and even overshadowing Prince William and Kate Middleton, according to body language expert, Judy James. Hmm. Isn't that interesting? Because 
Kate Middleton cannot do anything for the publicity of the family. You know, at the Grand Carnation, Meghan Markle can carry that weight. Now, it says, according to casting an expert eye over the cozy photo, Judy says the Duchess of Sussex is the standout star as, she's la as she laughs with the with Queen Camilla and Princess Charlotte while Kate Middleton appears downgraded. I've also been telling you guys that they are going to start, you know, throwing a few jabs here and there on Kate Middleton. And we're seeing the few jabs here and there coming, right? This is the insurance policy because I'm learning that, hey, Kate Middleton, you know, may potentially, you know, put some strict moves as it relates to her husband alleged extra marital affair and i'm learning that you know the british media are gearing up to ruin kate's reputation allegedly now it says speaking to the mirror judy also pointed out king charles has sought to airbrush history with the move Kate has received a body language um a body language downgrade here, standing to the side of the pose and looking outward. She appears stripped of her current status as the standout star of the firm. It's Megan who catches the the eye here, bending forward and laughing in delight as she shares the happy moment with Camilla and Charlotte in a very active and relaxed looking way end of that article <laughs> right there for us so i'm happy that this body language expert decided to chime in into this discussion and we can see that you know based on what this body language expert is saying and looking at the photo it really does depict megan markle in a bright cheerful manner and she does appear to stand out you know from the rest and i believe that this is like their bargaining chip because remember this is a photo for the grand coronation depicting them as a family unit but in reality you know we know that a picture does worth a thousand word but is this thousand word you know something that can save that you know monarchy at this point no because they have done far too damage when it comes to megan and ari people may say you know Megan was talking too much, but the mere fact that the royal family did not just spoke, they acted, it even speaks volume as to where they stand with Megan and Harry, you know, saying that they were no longer welcome at Frogmore, stripping them, you know, of their security. It says a lot about, you know, the family's actions towards Megan and Harry as well. They didn't care about their safety. So if they had displayed that publicly, just imagine what else they were doing to this couple behind closed doors. And that has always been how I view it. Because if you don't care about these two people, you know, safety, your grandkids, it means that you are a selfish individual and chances are they were enduring a lot more. But guys, this is just all I want to share in this video with you guys. Let me know what your thoughts are and we will talk in my next video. Bye guys.